<laughs> Episode 9. Oh my god. Oh, this is a long one. <laughs> Attacking! Quick, get down! The mass of tentacle is. I shall not go out alone. As I've said before, all will be washed away. Everything shall perish. I won't make it. <laughs> Did you really think you could leave me behind so easily? Oh, wait, what? Oh, oh, wrong person. <laughs> Did you really think you could leave me behind so easily? Ah! Oh, Asterius. You'll never hit me. Labyrinth of the Labyrinth. Oh, hey. I'm done running. I'm going to fight for Kijimuna. Now, cut him down, Brandon. Hmm. Ah! Time to sleep with the fishes! That was so late. <laughs> ah! You did it, Captain! Why am I floating? Uh, I swear. Save your excitement for when we're actually done. <laughs> no, man? I carried you up here so that you can aim. You gotta deliver the finishing blow to that bastard. do it me and my captain's rules totally destroyed Dagon my snakes have taken care of Triton all that's left is for Dagon to disappear hmm. I have requ request I wish for you to hear Dagon's dying words even though I have every right to hate him I could never bring myself to. Due to his insanity, he believed he was speaking the truth. He was forgotten by all. I hope for him to at least live on in your memories. He noticed you. I believe that Dagon looked upon you with an almost loving pity, Brandon. Even if the memories are simply forgotten, his memories of having been with you all shall follow him into nothingness. Right. You have my thanks, my child. <clears throat> you have my thanks. I can finally rest. I. Dagon, 
Lord of Canaan, I wish to die alongside my children as the All Father. I was the last of my world. I could never forgive myself for that. Why did you hesitate? Do you not know? It is obvious, is it not? You are my student. As I am sure you are aware, Triton is different from me. However, he is unmistakably a part of me. That is why I could not bring myself to hurt my students, to hurt you. Yes, I finally understand. I, I envy Triton. What I wished to steal away was not the role of the Allfather. What I wanted was someone to live beside and protect. That's why I hated him. <laughs> I feel that my time is almost up. Farewell, you who shall bear the same pain as I and Robinson. I wish to give you a warning before I fade, or a warning from one who has failed. Do not become a slave to your role, for it exists, for though it exists, it is not absolute. There is no such role that you are bound to. Do you understand? There is no such thing. Once you realize this, you can become anything you want. You can allow yourself to change from a wanderer to, to a wanderer, if you so choose. Do not possess the knowledge that I and that child do. I now see that it is your single chance of victory. If you knew in advance, you would become obsessed. You would be trapped within the strongest and also the worst system that mankind has ever created. It is a system that automatically deals with those who do not fit into it. They are reduced to nothing more than shadows. We know a bit about that, considering this game. <laughs> the moment you let yourself believe that you have lost your role, that is when the shadow will creep in, just like what happened to me. Such a shadow will eat away at your memories, distorting the very fiber of your being. However, you are free. Remember that if you feel like you're in trouble, <laughs> this is getting quite serious. You cannot carry these memories with you when you are washed from this world back to your own. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> I really don't understand, but Mr. Triton was saying the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> So he did! <laughs> Finally, I choose to leave you with a gift. My name is Dagon. I used to rule over heaven and earth. My name brought bountiful harvest. This is just about the last time I'll be seeing this scenery. We'll be going home in a few days. Once we return to our home world, we'll get our old memories back. I wonder if we'll remember this island. Does it really matter? I don't care if I forget. All that matters is we'll be returning to where we need to be. No matter how hard that path may be, at least it's the path we, cho we chose for ourselves. This island was just a detour. Think of it like that, it's probably best that we forget about this place. You only feel that way because you aren't an inventor. I can't progress without recording this discovery. You should record important things. That way, even if you forget them, even if you forget about them, you can remind yourself. Kurogane, was it? 
Kurigane? It was thanks to you that you carved into the wood that we realized our memories have been stolen, right? <laughs> I guess I gotta compliment you on that. <laughs> you don't need to compliment me or anything. I always record what I think is important. Anyway, I'm sure that whatever fate brought us together is not only limited to this time and place. Even after we go back to our home world, I'm certain we'll meet again. We will meet again. This conversation is totally baseless. We probably don't all come from the same world in the first place. I suppose so. But if we continue thinking about it and believing in it, I'm sure we can accomplish whatever we put our minds to, right? Huh? Where'd Brandon go? He just went outside. Are you not going after him? It's fine. I just want to let him know not to forget about me. That's what you were thinking about? <laughs> I swear. <laughs> Captain, you need to sleep some more. You, re you released a lot of power to your sacred artifact. If you don't sleep, eh, whatever. You just do what you want, I guess. Um, this world repeated over and over again, but... I'm so happy that I was able to meet you, Captain. No, Brandon. This is the first time I've ever met someone else like me. I finally understand that I'm not alone. Even when I was sad that I was alone, I could hold out because I was meeting you. Once we leave this island, I don't think we'll meet again, so... Uh, can we, um, hold hands a little while? I want to remember your touch. Okay. Yeah, sure. But, thank you! I... I never want to leave your side. I'm going to keep believing that we'll meet again. I'm sure of it. Because we're both wanderers. And we still have three days left until we return. Let's use that to make up for all the time we weren't able to play together. <clears throat> It'll be a bit of a diversion until my next job. Let's do all the things we wanted to do but never have been able to. Brandon, <clears throat> Brandon, I, I heard everything that happened on that d day. I heard about Kijimuna too. He never came back, huh? I wonder if he disappeared after saving us. I, I heard that the banya tree is looking healthy again, but... I wonder how he felt to be forgotten and then meet everyone again. Over and over. It wasn't only once or twice either. No matter how close he grew to everyone, he had to begin everything again from square one. Honestly, dang. <laughs> now that, that's just making me think of, like, saved games. That's just making me think of, say, oh my god, Undertale. No! <laughs> That makes me think of... Just makes me think of all the whole save games bit. I mean... It depends on, it depends on how you look at it. From whatever media you take in. Like, you get to the... Like, you get to the ending and you feel satisfied. But then, like, having to start over. But then having to start over and meet everybody again. Even though you know everything that's going to happen. That's kind of... That's... That kind of sucks, in a way. Hmm. Enough musing. Keep going. But I think... That just shows his kindness. He wanted to make everyone smile while they were trapped in this world. He knew nothing beyond this island. He earnestly thought that we would all be happy living here. He was always alone until we came. So he didn't know that there was any other way to live. Nobody ever taught him anything else. He never realized that he was lonely until he met you. Then, he sacrificed himself to save us. 
I suppose what he was doing was bad. But I can't bring myself to hate him. Thanks to him, I got to meet all of you. Yeah. Yeah. I wish we could see him again. Brandon! I don't know if we will, but... I hope that somewhere, somehow, we can meet him again. Kijimuna! Hey, where'd you go, Kijimuna? Kijimuna, what are you doing all by yourself? Mr. Triton, how did you know I was here? Any educator who can't find their students can't be a very good educator, can they? Are you afraid of what the others will say? Do you think they'll be mad? Is, that, is it that you don't want to say goodbye? You think seeing them will just make everything harder? I heard that Tangaro will be sending us home in three days. But... It appears that all he has to do is open the shell of the heavens. It seems that Dagon called me and my students here through something called Sumday. I remember this because it's a fundamental part of my knowledge. If we cut our ties to Dagon, then we should automatically return to our home worlds. Summoning? A way to travel between worlds? I didn't even know that something like that existed! Yeah, but those who are summoned can't choose their summoner. That said, when a summoner puts out a summon, whoever is able to answer, answers. Hmm. So, yeah, you don't get to pick and choose. <laughs> you don't get to pick and choose. Pretty much like the gotcha in this game. Dang it! There's a chance that our memories of this place won't remain once this battle zone has been lifted. The effects brought about by Dagon's power will reset. Then all of our original memories will likely return. However, once we're off this island, I'm sure that we'll lose any memories of this place. We aren't even sure if we're all from the same world in the first place. This may indeed be the last time we ever meet. That's why you need to go say goodbye, Kitchen. Mr. Triton, what do you think about these flowers? Do you think they're fool Do you think they're foolish or We must all choose our own paths. Even if someone else thinks those paths are ridiculous or foolish. For instance, these flowers are growing in a harsh environment, where they can barely take root. Even if they wither and die, nobody can say the flowers were unhappy. Oh, oh dang. I guess so. My children, I shall open the shell to connect the past between our worlds. <laughs> this isn't goodbye. I'll see you around, Captain. Even if you do run into me Even if you do run into me again, stay out of my business. Dude <laughs> I do nothing but get in your business. <laughs> I don't want to show my vengeful side to you all. <laughs> sad that we're parting ways. This isn't goodbye. And even if we forget each other for a little while, I'm sure that we'll meet again. I'll be waiting for that day. See you around, kid. See you, kid. Don't forget to treat me like your elder when we meet again. Hey, come on. Try not to cry. <laughs> Farewell, my students. No matter where you go, I will always be your teacher. You did marvelously back there, my children. I must thank you again, as creator of this island, and as your father. 
this conflict has taught me much about what it means to be Tangaroa. The, world's, the words of the All-Father of that other world, Dagon said, they have left an impression on me. You cannot hope to protect those who rely on you by hiding them away. I shall take my warriors and observe other worlds. I would be delighted if we ended up crossing paths again. Wait, 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 I don't think we should. I, I personally don't think we should. Just, like, just out of, just out of consideration of who's on the character roster, I don't think we should. <laughs> By the grace of the gods, we shall meet again. Live on in good health. Mr. Triton? Are you here to see Brandon? Yes! How is Brandon doing? His condition is stable. How are you feeling, Mr. Triton? During the field trip, you both... Thank you for your concern, but I'm alright. Can you let me talk to him alone for a moment? Sure, that would be great. He seems bored without anyone to talk to. I'll go get some towels. Please look after him while I'm gone. Make sure of something, Brandon. When we were on our field trip to Dream Island, we went missing for about an hour. D d d <laughs> A year passed in an oh my god, collisions are crazy. Or whatever happened, that was insane. Everyone, including Mr. Mononobe, said so. If that's the case. Actually, it's nothing. Please forget I said anything. Hey, what is that you're holding? Is that a branch? Mm -hmm. Is it important to you? I heard that you were grasping it when they found you. Broken branches like this don't last very long. I suppose we could always graft it onto a tree, though. Hmm, the branch is damaged. What? Oh, sorry. I'll give it back if it means so much to you. How about we put it in that vase for now? I'll bring you one. Wait. Wait here. I'll be back. Jimuna? Uh, how do you? Oh my god. Impossible. So that's how we got Kijimuna on our side. And what was an hour? What was an hour was like a freaking year. Oh my god, that that was a good one. 